one of the main things we've been trying to do ever since Hurricane Sandy is scale our ability to do analytics immediately after a disaster and in preparedness for a disaster. And one of the big challenges we've had is finding a way to teach more analysts how to make maps and do geospatial analytics. So that was really our focus for Cardo, is finding easy to use tools that we could teach any analyst to use so that we could more quickly visualize our data and use it to inform response. Well, Cardo is easy. It's easy and beautiful, and I think it, it very clearly fit into, you know, sort of a new set of modern software tools, um, if you want to call them self-service or just cool, that, you know, um, that analysts like to use. And what was really important for us is not only that we found a way to teach anyone how to make maps and do spatial analysis, but also to help them have fun with their jobs. So that was a big win for us. Really building a skill set across the agency and across the city for just doing more analysis, um, including location analysis. I think uh, for us, you know, we were a legacy SaaS agency, and so it's been very important for us that all of our analysts and that the people who understand the data best are able to analyze it in any way possible and to visualize it. Um, one of the things we're trying to get away from is sort of segmenting our analysis by a specific type of tool. Um, so it was very exciting for people who maybe are used to analyzing their data in tables to then also be able to visualize it. Cardo is fast, flexible, and easy. Um, it was really, we looked at a number of tools and most of them out there take a really long time to learn and they just, it's not as fast at being able to put something together quickly and then to share it quickly.